This video supports a case study showing the application of the concept attainment model in the teaching of chemistry. In this case study we're looking at the concept of molecular geometries and this is defined by the following attributes. The presence of lone pairs of electrons on the central atom and the number of atoms connected to the central atom. The lesson begins by presenting exemplar set 1 to the students. This set contains positive and negative examples, and using their knowledge of Lewis structures, the students compare the attributes in these positive and negative examples. Upon inspection of the Lewis structures for their examples, the students generate and define hypotheses, such as noticing the positive examples in the yes column all contain lone pairs of electrons on the central atom. The students are then provided with additional unlabeled examples, and based on their hypotheses, they are asked to place these in the yes or no column, identifying them as positive or negative. The teacher then confirms the student's hypotheses and names the concept, in this case identifies the molecular geometry that relates for these examples to whether or not they have a lone pair of electrons on the central atom. To consolidate, the students then generate their own examples and are asked by the teacher to describe and analyse their thought processes that led to the formation of their hypotheses. For this particular concept, there are more than two molecular geometries and so the process is repeated for multiple exemplar sets over a sequence of lessons. Follow the remaining three exemplar sets to see the complete process by which students attain the concept of identifying the molecular geometry for a given molecule. Use the supporting sheets provided in this case study to assist you. After going through each exemplar set, it's important that the students generate their own examples and analyse their thought processes for consolidation. After moving through each of the exemplar sets, the students should have attained the concept that the molecular geometry of a given molecule is defined firstly by the number of atoms connected to the central atom, and then secondly on whether or not there are lone pairs on the central atom. From this, they should be able to identify molecular geometries linear, bent, trigonal pyramidal, trigonal planar, and finally tetrahedral. Having seen this case study of application, which concepts defined by distinct attributes could be taught in your discipline using the concept attainment model of teaching?